Way Up with Angela Yee. I'm here. Mano's here. Yeah. Mano. Justina Valentine's here. What's up? And let's get into this Yee tea. So DDG and Halle Bailey have announced that they have broken up. Yes. Now, DDG posted on his page, Dear friends and supporters, after much reflection and heartfelt conversations, Halle and I have decided to go our separate ways. This decision was not easy, but we believe it's the best path forward for both of us. And they said they still love each other, deep and true, and they're focusing on their individual journeys and their roles as co-parents. Mm, mm, so mm. sad. I know. Well, that just breakup woman is the different woman. Man, they just had the <laughs> she baby, used, too. She usually hit the streets a little bit different Man, if she like, just broke up. Man, was like, mm. and I'm here for nah, you. I'm just saying, nah, it ain't about me. I'm just saying, like, if you've been in a relationship and you're tired of your dude or whatever, and he was putting you through something, I'm just saying in general. Okay. When she breaks off that, she's usually on demon time. What do the men do? Fact. Nah, we reflect. You keep doing the same thing. No, what's we doing? I was, you took the words right. out we of reflect. my mouth. They don't change nothing now because they were doing it the whole Usually way. after that breakup, <laughs> after that breakup. You just do it openly. She, no, she does things that she wouldn't normally do you like you did that oh yeah that's when you start posting like the thirst traps and stuff you like pepping your crazy. step you like damn you, you and you not... know what it's fishing when you write single and it that's when you, you like dms man. is open for business oh, all yeah. right well speaking of breakups cardi b and offset i mean the two of them people had thought maybe they got back together because he was posting himself inside of her studio and cardi b was very quick to shoot that down here's what she said I just saw your baby father in your studio. So is it this, is it that? I think y'all need to understand. We do have two cribs. One is in Atlanta, one is here. One thing I don't want to entertain is, uh, oh, we're in the same crib. Come upstairs, let's sleep together. I don't want to entertain that because that's what keeps us being in the same trap. Mm. Mm. That's the truth. Yeah, yeah. And they do have three kids together. Yeah. So they're going to end up in those. <laughs> he was coming know. upstairs. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so mad at Offset. Shorty ain't my shorty. <laughs> mm. uh, you know what, though? And I saw uh, academics uh, saying some things about who Cardi B, quote unquote, cheated with. That's I don't what know I'm if saying. they That's were on fresh a break, break or not. This is what I'm trying to tell you. It's well, the fresh well, break Listen, I'll tell you what. Y'all guys do what you want. And the second we give you a little taste of your own medicine, yeah. can't handle it. Mm-hmm. So, Because you know the bounce back is going to be crazy. Like, when people think about who is Cardi going to be with next? Insane. Cardi Because y'all is... be getting your feelings hurt. For sure. No, and Cardi's on top saying, of the world. You gotta. Usually women go through a phase where they just knock a couple of guys off. How do you know so much? <laughs> <laughs> Because <laughs> you're, a couple of you're, guys the, you're one of the couple of guys. <laughs> That's why. Okay. I'm all right. I'm usually a rebound. Well, here's you know a couple that? that's still going strong right now. Jennifer Hudson and Common. They've been dating for quite some time. And, you know, it, it looks like um, she was on the Jennifer Hudson show. Common and, Pete, Common and Pete Rock were on the Jennifer Hudson show to promote their album. But... Um, she was at, he asked, she asked him about an interview that he did recently on The Breakfast Club about marriage and all of that. I was asked about marriage. Yes. And I just answered honestly. I said, you know what? You told me a quote that your mother said, a man knows what he wants. Mm. I was saying my true feelings about, listen, if I should be married, it will be to Jennifer <laughs> Kate Hudson. He gets around. <laughs> Doesn't he? Uh, I don't want to comment because he's, he's dated a lot of people. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, no, yeah, nothing wrong. wrong. He was trying to see what he. But they're a cute couple. I like but that. But the friend. thing is, he he was in a relationship with all these women. He was, but he still has. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. Dated a lot of women. It's all, all right. Good. Well, here's what Jennifer Hudson had to say in response to that. My mother was right. I think that I think if she had a met you, she said, "I don't know about the rest of them, but that comment is all right with me." That's what she would say, <laughs> yeah. and I would agree. I think it's a beautiful thing. I think you are a deserving man, and I support that idea. Mm. And they both from Chicago. That's a cute love story. That's so cute. That's cute. They've been going strong since 2022. So it's been a couple of years. That's cute. All right. Well, that is your UT. Let's hear some, speaking of people getting back together, let's hear some Ashanti with Unfoolish. And when we come back, we have About Last Night, where we discuss what we did last night. It's Way Up. Way Up.